say hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to our day. Welcome to our day. <laughs> Good boy. I don't think I've ever showed you, but the other week, the other see when I was trying to make the mould, I said I had an obsession with ducks. Well, I do have princess ones as well, but here's like orange and yellow ones, and I've just put on my Christmas duck. It's that time of the year. This is a PSA. When the car is frozen like this and the moon is out, you should still be in fucking bed. Charlie just rightfully said that this looks like devil eyes. After all of that beautiful ice, devil eyes. So we're in the car, as you know, and this is what I see when I look in my mirror. And this is what it looks like in real life. <laughs> Me neither. It's way too cold and I don't like it. I want to go back to bed. I'm really not okay with this. Back to bed now, please. And yes, I am going out like this. I do not give a shit. So, these <laughs> very naughty melons, <laughs> which are not short, start to come down the fruit aisle. And literally, just as we get to the melons, these two just randomly sort of fly at us. Like, literally, across the aisle. So, we're uh, naughty melons. From over there. <laughs> They just flew out at us from to here. Finally, like they bounced. And there was nobody there. else in the aisle. No, I'm thinking what I'm thinking. I think they might have been put on the top one. Yeah. And then bounced out because it's too full. Yeah. But um, yeah. <laughs> I'm glad there wasn't a child there. I probably yeah. would have knocked them out. Yeah. Offending melon. So we're still shopping, as you can tell, and um, Charlie just suddenly stopped and was like, oh, and and I was just like, what? And she was going like. <laughs> And like looking down, and I was just like, I don't know what I'm looking at. Then I realised. Normal, normal, normal. No more, hello. <laughs> Who says women can't have one? <laughs> <sighs> We're having fun this shop, aren't we? Oh, oh gosh, okay. Yeah, we're leaving now. <laughs> Here I am. I've just put up Manny, the fragrant. Uh, Forest Gingerbread Elf, apparently. It's a game as well for your phone. Um, and I can't, I, I've lost my face. <laughs> By face, I mean my oxygen. I took my mask off, and then we were just coming into our, like a little estate thing. And I don't know what my face is. I had my face on, because it was pshht, pshht. Lots and lots, but uh, yeah, no. But we are home. Oh, blanket down. We got birthday stuff. I haven't seen any of it. No, she just had to help me get off the shelf because I can't freaking reach it. And then, <laughs> I made the <laughs> fabulous monster. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to have to hang it up for. Unless we want it floor length. I'm going to need Soph to help me put up her birthday decorations. <laughs> but I'm going to have to 
Because I'll call it reach. Nope. I won't know at all. Uh-uh. Ooh. Hello. Shiny. What is it? Manny. Oh. Um, we got some more decorations for the elf and the, the um, Father Christmas letterbox. <laughs> and we're going to get some more on Friday, hopefully, when we get paid again. Um, too much we always do it birthday christmas it always happens we just we do plan for it um but yeah and it doesn't help when you go into places like bnm no bnm is like torture and we need to go back in there on friday because they've got some really cool lights that we want to put up <laughs> oops on, right let's go Maybe. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so what I was going to say was, it's that time of year. So spurf day. Since we've been living with each other, I've always decorated a cake for Soph. And I've never done one for you. So you have done cakes for me. I? You did the ice cream cones. In Helen. We had the wafer ice cream cones and you put cake in it and you made them into ice creams. Looking like... I really don't remember that. Oh, they were so cute. I don't like wafer cones, so I must have really loved you. Yep. <laughs> Early stages of love. <laughs> I've decided I'm making you... I'm doing you a cake this year when you, for your birthday. My birthday's gone. I mean, like... Next year. Fine. Okay. Um, but yeah, every year I make a cake. I just... I have no idea what I'm doing at the time. It's kind of like... You just have fun with it, really, don't you? Basically, yeah. Um, they started off with just, like, these little piping kit things. And then... <laughs> You're getting more adventure <laughs> each year, aren't you? <laughs> and then it builds itself up. Like, we've bought tools this year. We did. <laughs> um, right, chin out. Yep. And mm. here it is... I think I've got everything. Here's what I got for it. Marty pan. Yum. Icing. Yum. Icing. Yum. Edible eyes. Yum. Round cake. Square triangle rectangle cake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like earlier all over again. Golden galaxy sprinkles. Rainbow popping candy. Coloured. Writing icing, chocolate and salted caramel writing icing, but they're like these different colors, so I'm hoping they're gonna taste nice. And then in here, you got like this flat smoothery thingy, a rolling pin, and then like all these different tools. And obviously, so, I don't have a clue about anything that she's got. Oh no, no. she hasn't seen any of it. Not a bit. Just put it all in the trolley. Yeah, and each one. But we don't have anything flat to roll it on. And obviously I can't go do anything with the kitchen counters because my knees get in the way and it's just... Painful. Yeah. So I've got a box that I've clean filmed so that it's, as they say on Extreme Cake Bacon, food safe now. <laughs> <laughs> just because they've covered it in either clean film or tin foil. So stupid. But yay! Let's see what I do! Here I am, just making Soph's cake, listening to some pink. And I just looked out the window. How gorgeous is that moon? So beautiful. Ow. Oh shit, that really does hurt my inside. Ow. It's like my ribs. You're looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> I was stupid, I let on the floor. What else can you use uh, Salbutamol nailer, saline stickers for? Spying on your wife! <laughs> Knowing if my wifey has looked in the box at her cake. Which I wouldn't do anyway. There are two on every side. 
I have no sellotape. <laughs> oh no, not sealing, salbutamol. I'll get it right though, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Off of my um, trusty little nebulizers. Oh. Boom. Oh. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Oh. Or whatever, which way ever it is. <laughs> I don't know. Probably that, isn't it? I don't know, that sounded don't right. Know. Have a gift. I have another I haven't finished it yet. Um, I've done the big cake. Of everything that I actually picked up, I actually forgot to pick up white icing. So I had pink and yellow to deal with. That's the only coloured icing I had. The cake's not gone how I was envisioned it then. Even though you didn't know what you were going to do anyway. I had a rough outline what I wanted to do, but... I needed more than pink and yellow. <laughs> yeah. And and it wouldn't have been pink if it had a, if it was actually coloured how it was on the box. It's shit as well. Really. Three pound or something. We yeah. About. It's this stuff that we got, and you see the colour. Hang on. That colouring, you will not achieve on the cake. It's so bad. Did you follow the instructions like it said? Roll the ice in, brush it on. It, it literally says, it sure? cover the cake with the rolling ice in, place the cake onto a worktop covered with greaseproof paper, empty half the contents on the shimmer sheet, slash of the shimmer sash, yeah, <laughs> onto the top of the cake, use a dry soft brush to dust. The ice in circular motions until the cake is covered using more shimmer if needed. And I used a lot of shimmer. It's really crap. Yeah. It's really bad. Mm hmm. Fans so. I wish that we'd had done um, what they probably did. So that it's this. To achieve that on the front. And that pink. Pretty sure to achieve that colour, they would have mixed it with alcohol yeah. or something. Yeah. And it doesn't say to do that. So yeah. Not the best. No. But I'm hoping I've used it effectively, so You know how tiny those um stickers you've put on there are? Yeah. What if they pop off when I open the box? Well when I lift the box. She's just said it right here on camera. She wanted to open the box. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> this is why I have so beautiful stickers on there. I do not trust her with the cake. Rude. I'm not you. <laughs> oh my god. I had my face buried. Oh, no, no, no. Is my nose cold? But my leggies are up like this. Is my nose chilly, Mama? Yeah. That's because it's so cold. We are boiler still doesn't work. Everybody's got cold noses. Every year, our boiler breaks. It's every single winter, isn't it? Yeah. It cannot cope. Instead of them replacing it, they just keep trying to fix it. And the worst part of it is, is the fact that pretty much it's always the same bit that breaks. Yeah. And what's even worse, yes, she did just hit my foot. And what's even worse is the fact that we haven't even put in the heating on yet. No, so and it's it, still it, broke. It's only like heating up, like dishing, dishwashing water, which is the only thing we really use it for. I contacted the housing team and they said that they'd put it on the emergency list, but it wouldn't be at the weekend because it's out of hours. And that was two weeks ago. So, yeah. yeah. To be fair, though, we have an electricity socket hanging off. Which we are not dealing with it because it's electricity. So we called them. The earliest they can come is the 13th of December. And I contacted, contacted them two weeks ago about that as well. We, so that's just under six weeks for them to fix like an electricity socket that is live and coming off the wall. So, that's not good, yeah. Though. Gotta love the housing team. But it's 10 o'clock now, so we're going to go sort meds. And you're going to throw that ball for Pickle because she is very depressed right now. Aww, you sad. See you in a bit.
So for Sophie's birthday this year, we've decided to completely go all out. Um, yeah. And I saw these balloons. Nope, that's a ban banner. I really want to say bandana, I don't know why. These ones. I'm guessing you can get them done by helium, whatever, but we're not. Although I was thinking if you do that, would it not like, is there not a possibility it might like flip around and stuff? I don't know. No, and I've just opened it and they're all in this like pile. You get a little straw and on each of them it says valve. And literally you just put the straw in, blow, and it comes out like that. I was thinking you so I guess like once it deflates or if you open up the valve you can let it deflate and then I guess you could just keep using it I don't see why not unless I don't know I don't see why not no but that's really cool we're okay with it let's see what it's like when it's finished step one complete Somebody uh, loves balloons uh, and um we did. She keeps uh, 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 coming uh, over. Uh, uh, what is it? Uh, uh, she wants to play, but she just hit the green one that's on the floor. She keeps spotting it. Can't help herself. Is the time just enough way to people? I got one last one to blow up. No, She normally plays fetch with like this. She just spends hours hitting it in the air. Hang on, you're gonna pop it. Hang on. Oh! <laughs> Alpha knows this and we're gonna bump so much she hit him with her tail and it flew. Oh, that's a green one down there. She's like, I wanna play with it. Oh, it came near me, Mom. <laughs> Princess, okay, it's a balloon. I don't know. Yeah, Dixie, she loves them. <laughs> Literally, this is all she does. I was like piggy in the middle. Good girl, Alpha, you're so pretty. Oh, <laughs> oh you missed it. Oh, 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 oh. Right. I fell off. You got a girl. Which? 
Often likes to pick it up by the little piece at the end. It's like she knows that it's delicate. But yeah, this this is her heaven. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love this so much. <laughs> you can hear her clack in her teeth, but she doesn't ever go to bite it. She just hits it. Her birthday, Dixie's birthday is a day after, so so obviously oh. these <laughs> will just one hundred percent go. Oh, I'm sorry, Abba. One hundred percent go to her. Girl. Oh no. Uh -uh. Stay there. Bring it here. Help, Mum. I'm gonna need your help. I missed. Oh, oh. <coughs> Man. Oh, she's tried to get it. It's stuck. She did do what I was saying just a second ago when she was getting it by the little knobby bit, but it got stuck. I managed to blow up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I managed to think it was like seven, and then I think the eight. She heard me, and then Rick, like twigged like it was a balloon. Like, I know that. Oh, are you okay? Was that one She's like next. Yeah. Yeah. Us having a hundred of these, yeah, for her birthday was a whale of a time. It literally filled up the whole living room yeah, from the I'm house. Abba, Abba, no. Oh, poops! I saw, I saw, oh, I saw paper cups and thought it was for me. Good girl. <laughs> Fish threw it at my face. <laughs> she threw it on my face. I was gonna do oh, that. Oh, I'm sorry. Now. Dixie's not okay that mummy's putting the balloons around the TV. She keeps staring at her and then Soph was flapping them around and Dixie wanted done but no. We've um made kind of a an area to put food and there's a tablecloth and we've got it so it can cover the front of it because we've got four dogs coming tomorrow. Well, there'll be four altogether. So, four spaniels with food at face height probably isn't the best thing. So, we've got that to cover it over. Yay! I take my cocomilla now. Yeah. And then I'm going to pause it and then I'm going to go back and then I'm going to walk you through the rest of it. So we've got this pretty shiny thing on the back door. Obviously in the daylight we're hoping that it might reflect nicely but it looks like a giant gem currently. And it's really pretty. 
And then, as you walk through, you've got rainbow bunting, rainbow balloons. Yes, that one is, that one's not gonna last the night. It must have been pop. <laughs> <laughs> Boo -hoo. Happy birthday, that little thing there. And we've got them shiny things there and there. And the table, which obviously that won't that won't be there and that won't be there and it'll be different, but yay! So um, it's 10 o'clock at night, I'm trying to finish Soap's cake and I just put the final piece in, or well, one of, look at this, and I dropped it. <coughs> I'm going to have to leave it because I can't get it up. <laughs> I'll show you, sneak preview. <laughs> My bumblebee <laughs> Oh my god. That nice Dixie. Because that is all okay. So oh, sniff it. What? It didn't come off. No, it's still I'm there. confused. It's still there. I, I no, no, no. Oh, I just, I could do that one. <laughs> I'm confused. Right, that's all. Oh. Should we get you an Alba treat? Yeah. Should we? Where's the treat? Look at that really white patch in her hair. Beautiful. Down here. Wait, avocado. <laughs> This I'll is Dixie. Yeah. What, what happened to the light? I turned it off. That makes sense. Because all I got is like the rebound off of her eyes. Oh. Isn't that nice? Yeah. You're just the cutest. Yes, you are. You're so cute, Dixie. I know, Mom. You're falling asleep. No, I'm fucking not. Shut up. <laughs> oh. So, this is our day. I think the next vlog that you're going to see is going to be a bit of a jumble of a couple of days. And maybe Sophie's birthday is going to be a little bit delayed. Just purely because there's Sophie's birthday and her parents are coming and we're having a little tea party. Um, but then obviously it's Dixie's birthday as well. So it's a hectic couple of days. We've got a couple of things going on as well. Um, so... I do apologise that these are a little bit 
all over the place. We're going to try and get back into the swing of vlogging again, but we have been quite put off. Mm. Um, we just feel like we're being watched and that's not what we did this for. We did this to make friends, I which mean, we that have. Sounds really, that sounds really silly. We feel like we're being watched, but like... By okay, not watched. We feel like we're being stalked. And like monitored. Yeah. Um, which it, it has put us off, but you guys... You are there for us no matter what, and we want to be as transparent as possible. Obviously, we can't with certain things, but it's just, it is what it is. Um, so if a vlog doesn't go out for a couple of days, we're just going to try and regather ourselves and our thoughts and just, obviously, we've got to protect our mental health. So things may not be as regular as before, but we are still here. Yeah. We are not leaving. No. We just need to take a few mental health break days every now and again. So, yes. but thank you to uh, one of our lovely followers who checked in on us to yeah. see if we're okay. That really meant a lot. We did. But, yeah, it is. I'm okay, idiot. I, I, I don't even know what you're She had doing. a drink. Did you have a drink? So, oh. we're going to go chill for the evening because we've got a very busy day tomorrow. And it's cold. Yeah. Yeah. So thanks for coming to stay with us. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone. Good night. Oh, that's my sleepy face. Good night. Gorgeous. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. <laughs> You're gorgeous too. Oh, yeah. Good night. Did you hear how you said that? Yeah. <laughs>